I'm in Iowa for work. We're going to a farm. We're going to learn about some farm animals. Point blank period. This is a bronze standard turkey. Okay. It is still in its baby feathers, so mm. you can imagine. Mm. Oh, you're so <laughs> and when I got to that farm, those people, that place, I mean, it was so overwhelming. I like literally want to cry because that's how special it was. No, they're not dangerous. They're all ready to go. Get one. I can't do it. I can't do yeah, it. Yeah, you can. I can't do it. The people, the way he was raising that family, it touched my heart, it touched my spirit to the core. Those children are amazing. You gotta juice it up. <laughs> <laughs> they know so much about the earth. Look on the other side of the tree and there won't be any moss. Because it only grows on one side? Yeah, it only grows to the north. Moss? That I didn't know that. Me Moss either. only goes. To, your dad taught you that? No, my grandma did. And animals. Wilson drinks his pee. Wilson drinks his pee. Not his pee. Which her? That's Wilson. One of the ways. Oh, look. That he'll sometimes stick his nose back there when she's squatting. Mm -hmm. Figuring it out. And get it all on his upper lip so he can get a good, strong smell. And it's just beautiful to see and experience. I know that it's been 15 minutes. I have a phobia of birds. <laughs> I'm scared of a lot of things. I understand that. But I am scared of birds. So I am hyperventilating right now. You said they're cool. I don't trust them. We discussed that the beaks. I don't I don't trust the beaks. And those children, they are they are just being raised in such an amazing way in this poly culture is what he said. Is that what it's called? These two fellows are called barrows, uh, because they're Boy pigs that have been castrated. Did you do it? I did not. And now I'm going to put on the bee suit. All right, so you see all that right there is all honey right there. Yes. Oh, oh baby. Wow. With those kids supporting me as I tried to touch that turkey and they didn't laugh at me. Oh, thank you. Can we just like splice in my hands like over no. hers? Okay. <laughs> Normal little 10 year olds would just laugh at this old man trying to touch a turkey. Jesus, give me the strength to touch a bird. They would have made fun of me. They would have tweeted about me. Jesus, give me the strength to hold a bird. Put all that stuff on Instagram and just embarrass me, but those kids supported me. Give me the strength to love a bird. And my mission to touch that turkey. I don't think it's gonna happen, guys. Yes. Yeah, it is. Thing is we yes. see you got know. this. And that's a testament to Des Moines. That's a testament to the type of people that I found here. Just touch one down there. Don't don't pick it up. Just touch one. No, I'm not touching it because I know they fly. No, they I'm don't fly. Because I was scared. I was scared shitless. <laughs> and, and I'm not being facetious. I have a literal phobia of birds. But when that little man said, "I believe in you," I believe in me, and I believe in the Lord. And usually when I bring him into the picture, I can do it. Couldn't do it this time. Oh, I thought that was something. <laughs> you feel that love, and I think that is that is the goal of any family, that's the goal of any sort of life. And I can do it. Oh, I can do it. <laughs> live it, live it fully. My name is Andrew A. Arrington, and I just had a bird! I just had a bird! Hey.